yours truly, Chris Levi13. And as you all may or may not know, I started this YouTube channel all the way back in 2012. And this channel is way different than what it started because this channel, if you look at what I do, I do primarily probably 99.9% of my content is in the gaming realm with live streams being at the forefold and then videos and posts about games and all that coming right behind that with what I do throughout social media. But when I started this channel all the way in 2012, many years ago, it wasn't about gaming because gaming wasn't in my mind. I mean, I played games, I had an Xbox 360, but did I think about, oh, I'm going to get ready for the Xbox One, oh, I'm going to get ready for the PS4. No, I didn't think about any of that, you know? I thought, well, my friend has a channel about wrestling, doing wrestling from his point of view while in with his iPod popping it up in his can in his bedroom, his mom's bedroom, downstairs in his house, uh, in the garage, wherever he could get at the time, and sometimes he'd have his friends that liked wrestling as well being in there. And he'd do mainly WWE topics and sometimes stuff topics outside of WWE. And it was really, really cool, you know, and I wanted to do something like that. And since he saw that I wanted to do that, we got to talk and he said, Do that, but put a spin on your wrestling. But also to make it unique, why don't you add wrestling into it? And then that came to rock and roll wrestling shows. Since I was a musician, I did backyard wrestling. Oh uh, yeah, and you know, and I wanted to do some in-ring wrestling, which I've got to accomplish that. And it was cool to do the rock and roll wrestling show. You know, now if I were to do the rock and roll show, since I have the internet and all that, I can get, I can get all these wrestling topics, all these music topics, and make that show ten times better. But that's not who I am. That's who I was in the past. But I made a promise to myself. Myself, even when I started doing more gaming in 2016 and in 2017 for the channel that I was still going to keep in some fashion or form wrestling and music on this channel. So this is where I need all of your guys' help. And the help is basically how do I incorporate in a gaming channel if a guy that, 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 that wants to stay true to himself, keep his originality, a guy who likes re likes gaming because game, gaming is one of my passions playing video games exploring these worlds learning about them learning about the creation of these games the way people other, like seeing other people that play these games likes watching streams likes creating streams and all this jazz jazz has a guy that likes all that about games but also likes all that about music and wrestling as well the ins and outs basically love all three of these passionate about all three of those things since he has a mainly gaming channel, how does a guy like me incorporate wrestling or music into the channel? I'm not saying that I want to incorporate live wrestling or live music. I want to incorporate it in, in, in maybe, how do you see that I can bring wrestling or music topics to the channel and it still be cool? I mean, how could I maybe place all my music on the channel, like play some originals or do some covers on the channel and it still be cool? How could I talk about what's happening with in WWE or maybe Impact or otherwise with AEW and it still be interesting and engaging to the fans because I feel like it'd be a disservice to myself if I didn't do this, but also with the with the revamp of my channel kind of thing that happened last year with the new banner and logos and getting merch and having a Patreon and having all this different stuff, I'm still trying to figure out figure out how to make this thing fully around because I've got like the like circle, you know, like, like this bubble that everybody stays in. They stay in and they go out of their bubbles every once in a while. But me, my bubble's always been since I've graduated high school has been I work my job, I hang out with my family and my friends, but I immerse myself in music, wrestling and gaming. And I want to add more music and wrestling into this channel in some fashion form. Do I need to do top tens of hey, here's my top Three, three WWE wrestlers, my top three Impact wrestlers, here's my top three wrestlers of all time, do I need to do top fives, top tens, what, you know, or could I sit there and say every once in a while I'll do a live stream where I talk about my thoughts and opinions on, on each month's pay-per-view in WWE or something like that, or when it comes to music, talk about, hey, what do I think about this album or that album or what, what, what do you, all the viewers, I know I'm rambling, but I just want to know what all you the viewers think would be cool to be able to incorporate that in somehow in some way, shape, or form. Could I maybe, hey, bring up WWE 2K19 because that's the latest game and I could do and I could do wrestling matches on that game, game, game and have fan, <coughs> fantasy wrestling matches and also 
while, while it's happening on the screen, I can sit there and talk about WWE and, and so on and so forth through that. Or maybe I can talk about the music and the games that I play and, and all of that. But I just want to know, I know I've been rambling here for the last couple minutes. You all the viewers around the world, I need your help. People that are part of the Chris Crew, that is the Chris Crew right here, how do you all see that I can incorporate that? I mean, the main focus of my channel is still going to be the live streams and then game and then gaming videos after that. But I just wanted to know, you all the viewers around the world, how can I incorporate that stuff into this channel, even if it's just a little bit? So if you have any ideas, please comment them down in the comment section below. I really, really appreciate that because I'd like to see my videos get start getting more comments, get more traction down there. Because I know you all, I know there's people that, that watch these videos because they'll tell me in their live streams, they'll tell me in, via box or they'll tell me via via uh, messages and all this and DMs and all that. And I'm like, if you watch my videos, why don't you take time and also comment down there? So if y'all have any suggestions on how I can improve my gaming content, but, but more importantly, this video is about how can I incorporate my passions for music and wrestling on this channel as well. Please let me know down in the comment section below. And you all stay awesome.